I got to share this with you. And I, I wasn't going to talk about this, but Go I, I, I've got to share this okay. with you. Okay. Um, <laughs> I did a, a, an amusement park that we both have worked. Oh, yeah. Uh, back at the end of June. Mm-hmm. Do my show one night. Killed. Great show. Come down off the stage. I've packed everything up. I'm walking out of the room. And this woman is standing over by the snack bar. And she says, uh, um, I want you to know that I was very offended by your show. Too bad. And I said, well, no. well, yeah, well, no, no. <laughs> oh, I thought all kinds of things I was going to say there, but it, it gets, it gets really good. Oh, no. So I was like, I'm, I'm really sorry. I said, what, how, in what way did I offend you? Well, you called that guy in the audience, the dead guy. And, uh, the puppet picture on somebody in the audience, it becomes the dead guy because he doesn't respond right away. And, uh, and, and the guy was laughing, and she goes, and he didn't appreciate it. And I said, well, was he related to you? Was he with you? Um, no, no, but I talked to him afterwards, and he didn't like it. Well, he, he was laughing during the show. Well, maybe, but he, he told me he didn't like it. But you will, at times, get people who feel like they can dictate to you and tell you what you can and can't do. And you're always going to offend somebody. Always, no matter what you do. And it's never the person that you're directing the right. humor to. Right. It's always somebody else who's afraid for that them. they're going to be offended. Right. right. It's yeah. always they're afraid for somebody else. Always. And and that's you can't worry about that kind of stuff. No. I look at them and go, well, have a nice day. And I walk away. I don't want to hear it. I don't need to hear it. I don't care. You know, and I know that sounds cruel and mean. Oh, I want to come back at them. I want to get them going, oh, what did I do? <laughs> I would love to I turn just, the table. Oh, and I I have done that, and and, and it's it's gratifying, but it usually ends terribly. Yeah. <laughs> so so anymore, I just go. Well, you have a nice day, and I hope your day gets better. And I walk off. And and you know, here's the thing too, Tom, that people need to understand. In comedy, if somebody's not offended, you're not doing it right. Mm-hmm. Sorry. And I don't mean by being dirty, and I don't mean by being nasty, and I don't mean by being uh, whatever. Comedy is built out of pain. And when you do something that comes from your pain, somebody else has shared your pain. And maybe they're not over their pain yet. They're going to be offended. They haven't come through their pain and got out on the other side yet. They're going to be offended. It's just the way it is. It is. And, and you can't change your show every time somebody says, I'm offended. For some reason, everybody in America thinks they have the right to voice the fact that they've been offended. Mm-hmm. Nobody cares if you've been offended. Now, there's 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 being offended, and you kind of go, I don't really care for that, and you move on. And then there's being offended where you're ready to fight. Well, I mean, if somebody yeah. offends my wife or offends my family or says something, nah, nah, we've got a problem, okay? Mm-hmm. But other than that, I'm going to go, eh, it wasn't my thing, <clears throat> so what? Keep going. Well, that was it. This is a free park that I'm working yeah, in. Yeah, a fr- they you have, notice that? Free park. Free park. <laughs> free park. They don't pay to see the show or anything yeah. else. And, you know, it's... For, Move on. There's other things to do. Yeah, yeah. yeah but your life should be bigger than this. Yeah, and yeah. it's not. And it's, it's not. sad. It is, and it's a lot sad. of those people have. They cannot control their jobs. They cannot control their home life. They cannot control anything in their life. And they go, "Hey, I can control Tom." <laughs> you know? no. And that's what they try to do. Yeah. That's how yeah. it comes out. And you can't worry about that. And if you change your show every time somebody says, "I am offended," but you will not have a show. If you if you don't speak your voice. And appeal to your crowd. You can't be generic. You can't be one thing for everybody. Right. Because then they're going to be offended because you have no show. Yeah. <laughs> is, that wasn't very good. Yeah. yeah that it, sucked. It, it, it might it might appeal to the woman who was offended, but it wouldn't appeal to anybody else. She'd right. be the only one in there watching, right. and she already thinks I suck. So it right. doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> and you're not going to change her mind. No. You know, in three so, more years, you could be on t- the. F- front of People Magazine is the world's best ventriloquist, she'd still think you suck. Yeah. Yeah, it ain't going to happen. And, and you're, but I'm, I've, I've got, I'm, maybe I'll order that. Yeah, yeah, there you go. <laughs> and go, do I suck here? Look, People Magazine. People Magazine. They don't lie. 